Yeah, I remember we talked about that one time. We were talking about universal basic income. I wonder if I would like it or not. Well, it'd be nice to have money where you don't have to think about food. Right. And don't have to think about rent. The problem with that is it's, it's very difficult to just motivate yourself if you've got your food and your rent taken care of and, you know, you're, you tend towards laziness. You don't have a history of discipline. Especially now they got all those weighted blankets, too. Do you see that? <laughs> can you believe that shit? I could sleep on a fucking floor of a bus station. <laughs> I don't need a weighted blanket. I'm always tired. Dude, one time I was on this bus, man. I used to go work at this farm in the summer. And so I would take the bus up there to Greyhound. And they had this dude on there. He's sitting on there next to me. And he's like, hey, you want to see something? And I thought it was going to be his dick, <laughs> his you dick. know? Because, you know, it's a fucking Greyhound <laughs> bus. He says, yeah, you want to see uh, something It's either a human head yeah, or a dick. <laughs> <laughs> either way, you're getting a head, bro. Yeah. But and, and I said no the first couple times, but the trip got longer. And I was like, all right, fuck it. You know, yeah, I'll see it. He opened up. He had a bag of jewelry and a gun. He had robbed a... Uh, a jewelry store before Jesus he got on the bus. Christ, and he wanted you it. to see it? He just wanted, yeah, I think he wanted to kind of take some of the pressure off of him by sharing it with somebody else. You know, I got an accomplice or something, and then he even said, like, oh, we should get off at this next stop, and I'm like, I'm not in this shit. <laughs> He's going to throw the bag at you and call the cops. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I found him. <laughs> <laughs>